So fast forward Lubulu. Yes. Last season nilikuja kuona umejoin soko paka. Yeah. I was so happy. Yeah. What happened? Kwa sababu tumesikia ume sign tena within a short while Lubulu ametoka soko paka. Yeah, ni kweli ni tuli sign hata tuli tuli unveiliwa and all that. Yeah. So ika come after easy to kwa 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 za easy uh, elite cup elite cup yeah. yes 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 after umbuko ulifunga bao hata yeah hata ndio nilikuwa game yangu ya mwisho tena sofa park oh yeye ni mfunga yeah. uh-huh. so after hiyo game ndio tulimaliza mhm ikakuta na team akanisha akanisha pia ati kuna vile mafuno yetu yamekuwa wengi mafuno eh uh, mafuno yetu yamekuwa wengi mm-hmm. so ilibidi you know cuz already wala mafuno walikuwa hapo wamekuwa hapo kutoka kitambo kiasi so akapata mini mbeka mimi msemnyu so na feel na feel kitu kama hiyo aliamua yani tawacha wacha wani 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 release kwa baki na wale wale wamekuwa nao wewe unaona alikufanyia haki of course wako nifanyia haki but eh cause cause kama unasema ulikuwa umesha sign so wewe si shida yako kama foreigners ni wengi ama ni wachache si ndio kweli kweli did you read the contract vizuri wewe ah to be honest I took part of time ya ku soma hiyo contract that much mm, ulikuwa excited sana yeah, nile ile furaha unajua mara kwa kwanza kusema wakati wa premium mhm ile furaha mtu anakuanga okay hiyo ni mimi nasema yeah. mimi sio watu wengine but mimi nilikuwa mm-hmm. nimefurahi sana mhm yeah so yeah kasain then after hapo akasema ti mfurahi na ni wengi mhm ikabidi wani waniachilie na ukwenda ku demand kusi, unajua ili ku affect yes so ukamwa ku bebeo bad and we alone ah niliamua tu ah uh, acha tu nikubali vile iko mm-hmm. ni move on cuz mm-hmm. the moment kiamua kukaa tena hapo kufikiria kufikiria mambo mingi mingi mi kwangu niliona haita ni help okay you know it's better ku ku move on na ku find another, another another team as fast as possible kwa hiyo time pia nini ilikuwa inaenda kufungwa window eh yeah, window ilikuwa inaenda kufungwa yeah. mm-hmm. mm-hmm. what did you learn from your incident when you come a player wow, kitu ni learn as a summer ni in life too in general mm-hmm. uh, you know ile time unaona nga vitu zina na work uh-huh. your way uh-huh. you know time unapata labda haikuwa hiyo njia ilikuwa labda njia ingine na kam si hiyo ni ulikuwa nafikiria unaonekana cuz hiyo ilikuwa nimeonekana ndio hii unaona hadi ume sign nini so kitu lani kwa life you know ukipatwa na let's say shida ama struggle for in life mimi na believe it's better kuiondokea as fast as possible before it could break down unaona ikweke chini so it's better ujiondoe mapema tafute mbinu zingine tafute njia zingine ya kufanya kitu kingine ama the same same thing but on, kwa kwa maybe kama 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 history ya ball mm-hmm. ni poa utoki kwa history ya sofa paka utafute be zingine ya kucheza yani umuvu tu na life cause the moment amo ku ku hang on hapo mm-hmm. i think mentally pia uh, ita ita itakusumbua okay yeah. okay 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 yeah. cause pia si mara ya kwanza actually eh uh. uh, cause in 20 11 ligi ndogo tulinanga UK England kulikuwa na tournament fulani ito Akil ilikuwa ilikuwa Akil tournament hiyo actually hiyo Akil ni university Akil university okay na ngao huko tukacheza hiyo ligi i mean hiyo tournament nini atuku manage kushinda and all that but sasa mimi nilipata opportunity ya ku ya kubaki nene njaribu nene matrials kwa teams okay okay tulikuwa na boy fulani ito wa Kulio ndio kulio hata amecheza amecheza posta mhm amecheza posta eh amecheza posta na timu ya then KCB kama scorong yeah, hadi yeah. akapata opportunity kwenda Portugal mhm yeah but say i think i think ama cha ball alipata injury ya magoti okay yeah so hiyo kwenda hiyo kill mimi na huo kulio ndio tupate mm-hmm. opportunity ya kubaki okay ndio tulibaki eh eh chama na ligi ya ligi ndogo uh, Chris Amimo uh-huh. alituganizia trials Uh-huh. na Crystal Palace. Ah. Yes, hiyo time I think Crystal Palace ilikuwa bado championship kama siko wrong. Uh-huh. So tulipata opportunity. So ilikuwa tuende hiyo 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 ilikuwa na Saturday. Mm-hmm. Tuende hiyo trials. Mm-hmm. 
God willing to never leave it to Mr. Kua. So unajua ilikuwa ma, for me ilikuwa mara yangu ya kwanza kufika UK. Mhm. Eh, kufika England actually. Mm -hmm. So siko najua ku connect hizi train kufika mali uko ilikuwa tuende. <laughs> so ukapata <laughs> tulichelewa. Okay. Eh, Tarehe zikuwa na 11. Atakuwa na msee. Okay, okay. Eh, ni vitu pamoja tu wenyewe. Tulamka tu mapema kawaida ndio tu mapema. Eh. Kaza kupambana kulizezo watu maswali ni aje tunaweza connect aje. Oh. Okay. Ndio pia pia dunia ni funny ile design. Unaweza pata pia msee mwingine atakupima. Eh kweli. Ah, hiyo ni kitu funny. Hata mtu kama Gio njia, eri hata kuambia ah sijui bado. Eh. Atakudanganya nini vitu kama hizo. Eh, eh kweli. So tulipambana na kuli hapo. Mhm. Mm eh kutafuta hiyo hiyo location walikuwa walikuwa tuende hiyo trials wa Crystal Palace yes uh -huh. tukafika but tulifika late uh -huh. ilikuwa naanza 11 uh -huh. si tulifika kitu kama 12 okay every okay. time trials imeanza mhm uh -huh. eh, actually hiyo ndo siku yangu ya kwanza na ya mwisho kuchelewa uh -huh. kwa life yangu kwa malipopote nilikuwa naenda <laughs> yani eh? ilikuwa 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 painful sana ilikuwa mm. painful sana sitatangaja mhm mm ilikuwa painful sana cuz ilikuwa opportunity for lifetime yeah 